You are ready to design and build the home of your dreams, but you have no idea where to start. There are a lot of options out there, and you are bombarded with different companies all claiming that they are the ones to bring your dream home to life. The thing is, you have pictured this home in your mind for a long time. You have planned and saved for this, and you want it to come to life in the way you envision it. You know that design comes first, but you've heard about this thing called design build, and now you think it would be easier to go with a single service provider, like an all-inclusive one-stop shop for a house. Does that sound like a good idea? Here's the truth. Why would a construction company want to design a house? Simple, so they get to build it. That is where their real profit is. When design and build are the same company, there is an undeniable conflict of interest. Design build is a big risk because your design team is not working for you. Think about it. If your designer works for your builder, they are looking out for the company's best interest. When something goes wrong, if something is not done right, whose interests are prioritized? Who are they going to keep happy? That's right, their boss, because that's their job. So, who is looking out for you? What you need is an advocate someone in your corner throughout the entire process to ensure that you get the home you have dreamed of and planned for. A designer works for you, not your builder. In fact, part of a designer's job is holding your builder accountable to build your home as it was designed. An independent designer is that advocate that you need. Design build firms will argue that a designer doesn't know what it costs to build a house and therefore will over-design it blowing your budget designing something that you cannot afford to build. We agree that a builder should be part of the conversation in order to achieve accurate pricing. We include them in the early planning of nearly every home that we design. We just know they should be separate companies so that your best interests are kept the priority. We know that builders know best what it costs to build something. We rely on the expertise of the builders that we work with. But no one can accurately price something unless they know what it is. Having a complete design prior to starting construction is the only way to have certainty in project costs. Any estimate created prior to completing design is based on cost allowances and is very likely inaccurate. After all, how can you know what something will cost without knowing what it is? Where does it come from? How much of it will I need? When you work with a designer, your design documents are deliverable to you. With a complete set of design documents, you have a say in who builds your home. A team is formed with the builder you choose. Your designer supports and advocates as questions arise during construction because they are working for you. When you work with a design build company, you are tied to having them build your home often rushing through design and beginning construction before design is complete. This is where design build falls apart. That early estimate you received is not seeming so accurate anymore, but you've already signed on as a client. Sure, design build can work, but you need to ask yourself, is it worth the risk? Because with no advocate, you are trapped, and it is uncertain that your home will be built as you dreamed it. Don't design build. Design and build separately, and choose a designer who will look out for your best interests, advocating to ensure that what was designed is what is built. To get started, visit our website, www.saragallup.com, email info at saragallup.com, or call 604-952-4448.